I mean, as you'll hear throughout, this event is significantly bigger than the last time we hosted. Um, the games are now broadcast on ESPN, and the audiences um, around the country are going to be watching this game, uh, the event, the games, I should say. Um, and it, it helps remind them that New Orleans is a great place to host an event, and it's a great place for people to come and visit. So it's very important to us, and to the economic impact, you know, in 2013, uh, the economic impact was around $43 million for the state. Um, so we anticipate with this being in a larger event, the more events surrounding it, we, we think we're going to eclipse that this go round as well. Anytime we can partner with the NCAA is a unique opportunity for us um, as the host institution. Um, an, entity, an entity as prestigious as the NCAA and with one of the premier events that the NCAA puts on in the Women's Final Four uh, is an unbelievable opportunity for us um, from a branding standpoint, um, from an institutional awareness standpoint, um, and then the fact that it's in our backyard right here in New Orleans to be able to partner with folks throughout the city um, and to bring them to our campus. So again, from a brand standpoint and awareness standpoint, it's special for us. Yeah, I'm really excited to, uh, in my first year, to have experienced all the events that Jeff uh, listed out earlier. And the opportunity to partner with Tulane, uh, we're two of the, I think, seven institutions here in the New Orleans metro area. So to partner with them on an event this prestigious is awesome. And uh, I'm really excited to be a part of uh, a part of the women's final four on this end i've had a chance to go before so to be on this end and see the behind the scenes and all the work that jeff and you lynn and everyone in this room has put together is awesome and and we all know that this event is more than just basketball as you mentioned and for a lot of major events like the women's final four it, they can sometimes feel inaccessible for the local community. So it is our job as local ambassadors, being a part of the local organizing committee um, and working with the NCAA and, and kind of being your liaison here in the community to help build those relationships and connections to where the event does feel more tangible for that community. Well, yeah, of so course, we, we were awarded this six years ago, so um, this event has been six years in the making. Um, and it, it's, again, it, it's a much bigger event than we're used to, and we're very blessed to have a number of entities involved. Um, obviously, as we mentioned, the two co-host institutions with UNO and Tulane, also the Sugar Bowl and the Greater New Orleans Sports Foundation, we're all working together. And we have different, um, it, it's a community-wide effort. We've got Dillard University and Xavier, who's involved as well. We've got the Smoothie King Center and their staff, which has been phenomenal, as well as the Convention Center. And also, um, it, it's, this couldn't have been done without the city. And I know um, she slipped in um, right as we started, but uh, Councilwoman um, Wynn is over here. We thank you for coming today and all your support. Um, but from the city level, starting with the mayor's office, the city council, um, and all of their departments across the board, whether it be Homeland Security, EMS, fire, everybody, it's been a, um, a, wonderful, a wonderful partnership. To, to have everybody included. So, like I said, it's, it's been six years in the making. It started as the occasional phone call, the occasional visit, and over the last year, it's ratcheted up quite a bit. Um, we're meeting in town, NCAA comes in town on a monthly basis, which started out as weekly calls, is now up to daily calls, which is all part of the, uh, part of the fun. So I think we're in a, in a very good spot, planning-wise. And from expectation, you know, our goal here as an LOC is um, to exceed the NCAA's expectation. As Monica mentioned, the relationship is extremely important to us. Um, our goal is to execute the event flawlessly. Um, and there's a reason we're very blessed that you guys have awarded this for a record fourth time. But our goal is to give you a reason to come back for a fifth and keep extending that record. So we're very excited.